Welcome to DeSoto High School. This is the Director of Pub Public Relations and Communications for the DeSoto Independent School District. Today, I am with you for a tour of our V4.2 DeSoto High School campus. This video will be utilized by new students to ensure they know their way around. So first, you will enter through the student entrance. This is our main system for our box system, which can be found up here, and our store system, which is being renovated. We also have a settings tab, which you can change your color background as seen, and your fonts as seen here. There are many different colors and fonts you can choose from. If you don't want to see this, you can also click on these two things and it won't show them. The game music is the music in game. So if you want to listen to your own music, you can listen to your own. First off, we will be coming this way to the cafeteria. This is where you have your breakfast and lunch. There is the main stage and back there is the Eagles shop and the hallway to get to the um, second pod, which you'll be seeing in a minute. Over here is our lunch and breakfast items. Some of these are still a work in progress. So if you come down here, I'm just going to fly my way over here. You will come to the auxiliary gym and the competition gym. For the physical education course, you will be using the auxiliary gym, seeing as it's both a gym and a classroom. And then if you go walk right out here, back this way, here's one of our wonderful teachers. You will be meet, met in the competition gym during assemblies and um, yeah, sometimes other gym classes, you'll be met here. So now if we make our way past the cafeteria, past the student entrance, we find the courtyard. This courtyard is utilized as um, science classes, uh, other types of classes which teachers can plan for you to come out here, and for breakfast and lunch. We are currently undergoing some renovations to our classroom, so ignore random desks in the hallway. Um, over here is our first pod. This is the most important part of this video. Over here, oh, by the way, pod one has marked A room number. A room number. A room number means you're in pod one. So when the schedule pops up and it says first A, um a 204 you that means you go into pod one and go to money matters so pod a 102 is united states history a 204 is money matters a 205 is the special education room over here we have a little uh, collaboration space and over here you can see um our sports and what's going on between them for tryouts and practices. A201 is English 3. A203 is ISS, also known as in-school suspension. A205, once again, special education. So now if we walk this way, we come outside. This is the hallway that leads to the cafeteria and the courtyard. This is an exit in case of a fire drill or an evacuation. So if we go over here, this is the second pod, also known as pod B. Um, so if we come over here, pod B's um, room numbers are indicated as B, room number, B, room number, etc. Over here, B206 is Algebra 2. Uh, B208 is Debate 2. B210 is the Environmental Science Room. This, uh, yeah. 
and you also have another exit over here. And then B207 is the band room. Each classroom has a different formatting, and we also have another collaboration space here. So each classroom has a different formatting um, to accommodate diversity. So we have these, and we also have these and a bunch of other formats. Over here, we have exits to the courtyard and to the cafeteria. Eventually, when bus services return, buses will be departing from here at the end of the day. And then when we come back over here, we have the administration offices and the main office. These are assistant principal offices. This is the secretary area. Normally this back area will be open, so if you wanna get a cup of coffee before you enter the school, you can. Over here we have principal's office and more assistant principal's offices. These offices down here are guidance counselor and administrative offices. Over here is the staff conference room, which can be utilized by students at times. And we have a little staff wall of wisdom collaboration space and the faculty room. Notice how in places uh, you have multiple exits. Please follow the direction shown above. See so. For um, evacuation point C, if your classroom says C, evacuation meeting spot C, you will follow the C chart and this will be the C exit. If for say you are evacuation point D, which is also listed here, you will follow evacuation point D exits and then meet at these little flags. That is pretty much everything we have at DeSoto High School version 4.2. We will be getting new um, schools soon and more campus tours will be shown on that. I hope this video found you well and helped you get a better understanding of where everything is located. Thank you for watching this video. Good day.